Checkmate. Max. No. Max. No. Max. No. Max. No. Max. No. Max. No. Max. Get me, you stupid toilet! Hello, Captain Glaskowitz. Hey, saludos. These new people, Capitan, I don't trust them. Then I never trust people. See how the old man stacks up. Hello, Hibleskovich. Anya gave me this workstation so I would not be completely useless, as she said. But it was broken in the attack. Herr Bombate here said that he could fix my problem. Head back down to the so hidden entrance in the locker room. Grace needs a nuclear warhead from the stockpile in Section F. Did you 
see the new kill house set built in the shooting range? I tried it. Good evening, Captain Blaskovitz. Fishing for that nuclear warhead now. Got it. Keep me posted. Blaskowitz, got a heads up for you. Looking at the engineering map, there seems to be a defense system guarding the nuclear warhead stockpile. I count four hibernation sarcophagi in the vicinity. Be ready for anything. Brace out.
still copy. This is the conclusion I've reached. Whatever happens, she can't know she'll be rearing our babies alone. It's my burden to bear. Until it's hers. Here's what I'll do. Keep away from her. Let nothing show, Caroline. This dying is making me a liar. Set, was it? I briefed him on the particulars. Careful, Shimshin, it's not the Tots cam. It, you, you okay? Well, let me look at you. You're a little pale. You have nausea? Any uh, fever? I'm fine. Never better. Never better. Well, I need to take care of this. You need to rest. I'll sleep when I'm dead. I'll do me a favor. Before you die, go to Grace. She's at the helm. You know, Caroline's old room. Set. Mm. 
Mm. Seth. Yes, Mr. Vlad. Hey, have you ever talked to God? God? Yes, many times, many times. Oh, wow, man. And what'd he say? Still waiting for him to get that. Why? Palmer. I was just hoping you could help me figure out something I saw earlier. Yeah, what did you see? I saw highways in the sky, you know? Don't touch it! Light just reaching across galaxies in it. It was like these, these symmetrical patterns of, of color, and I was just blasting through them at the speed of light, and mm -hmm. it, it was like reality. It, it warped in on itself, and it, somehow I was breaking through these dimensional barriers, and I could see everything, uh -huh. except I, I had ceased to exist. I mean, I was, but I wasn't I. This is very interesting, yes. And, and from my vantage point, there were like these, these patterns of light that formed these roots that, that reached out into this infinitely colossal shape, like, like a geometric tree that was just bigger than the entire universe. And, and then I, I heard something. This, this voice just thundered at the center of my awareness in uh -huh. this, this being, this shape. It spoke and it just said one word. What? Visitor. Visitor. Just that one word. Visitor. I, I don't know, it's, it's hard to explain. Amazing. This is, it's a dot. The ten Sephiris. Oh, yeah. The ten. What? These visions, how did they come to you? Oh, like in, in a dream. In a dream. This is astonishing. This is astonishing! I have very little books on this subject in English. Oh, 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 oh. Now, listen to me very well. Study this. Very well. This is really important. Any revelation. Any observation, anything, come to me. You understand me, Ingele? Thank you. Right on, Seth. Right on, Mr. Wyatt. Oh, thank you. Right on. William, the twins are kicking again. I think they can sense when you're near. You look hungry, girl. I like to stick knife in the side of the Hello, Blaskowitz. You've got a powerful ally in good grace, Blaskowitz. The grub you got here on the boat is dynamite been living off of mild and radioactive canned goods for fucking forever. Yes, hello, Captain. Uh, my friend from Warsaw. He studied mathematics in New York City. I never hear from him after Nazis drop bomb. I will thank you again, Captain, for freeing us from Camp Palika. It was a horrible place. You okay? Hey, 
Hey man. safe, Barbara. That's what matters. Don't you worry. It reminds me of when the bomb fell. Being deep underground and trapped. Feeling Mama's hand. Or well, holding on to it. Yeah, but on the upside, there's no radiation, no Nazis, hidden from the world. about in New York. Greetings. All my willpower, not to scratch. Well, they got this Hello. Is that Hello. Don't. William. What? I feel like you've been avoiding me. What's wrong? something out we always do huh? hey why why won't you at least try because I'm fucking dying
Oh, do you can see the future now? Don't act like you know things you can't possibly know. Well, the toilet works. Sushi, are you still here? You need to haul ass back to Mission Control and get all your ducks in a row. Now, the Haas 2 helicopter is spinning up in the hangar, and it'll get you as far as Galveston, but from there, baby, you're gonna have to improvise. Dynamite, boss. Blazkowicz, head on up to the hangar and make sure that Haas 1 is mission ready, all right? so accustomed to having a Geiger count on me all the time. Hey, B. Captain Bessons. Right. Let's see if this bird is ready to fly like Grace asked me to. Put everything else out of your mind. Good to go. Thanks, ma'am. Mm. I think it's time we had a gathering. Enter and pass up through the gates to attain to the 32 paths of wisdom. I, but in reference to what? Hey, little storm man. Are you ticklish, buddy? Max! Jesus, Max! I didn't see you there. Look, Max, I'm doing some, like, really heavy reading here, and your little toy robot is just not compatible with that type of soul journey, man, okay? Max, hot. Max, it's all right, pal. Look, this just is way too complicated for you. Why don't you go play with your pig or something? See, I'm trying to find the reference to these gates here, and... 
as if he just would not understand. Max Hoss. Max, this is really advanced philosophical <laughs> literature here, okay? You can't just start pointing to... <sighs> Max, that's it! How did you... Need you in the helm, Wyatt. All right, y'all. We got some hell to raise. You got a boat full of news, and I got a target. Fucking good one, too. Woo! Right on, boss! Yeah, that's where it's at. That's cool, all right. I dig. Check it out. I sent Specie ahead to his hometown of Roswell, New Mexico, to prep for the mission. Now, there's a tunnel that's accessible through Specie's hideout that will take you straight into the Nazis' top secret underground base where they're experimenting with some sort of wigged out alien technology. That's well, New Mexico, you say? This is one of ours. What do you mean? One of yours? Yeah, wouldn't you like to know? So you can send coded messages back to your pals in Berlin? No! What the fuck is she even doing here? Grace, why she's good people? She's a fucking Nazi. On your boat. What were you saying, Pops? Hmm? Hmm. That secret base you were talking about was constructed by us. That's you. One of our biggest safe keeps. Yeah, it was located here, underground, near what is now Roswell, New Mexico, but it, it existed for a thousand years, long before America got subjugated by the Europeans. It contained technology related to anti-gravity research, something that could easily turn the tide of war. We gave the U.S. government access to it. Unfortunately, it was too late. America fell. The Nazis took hold of our safekeeping. Shit. That's not gonna sit well with Speci. He had his bet on space aliens. He once saw a ship that crashed back there in 47. So what do you want with this place? Know what the Oberkommando is? Yeah, baby. That's where all those big shot jerks running the Nazi war machine hang out. Yeah, well, the Nazis moved it into your safe keep set. So whatever it is is so important that the whole upper echelon of the Nazi leadership left Berlin and set up shop in New Mexico. This is why you need this for. That. This is a portable nuclear bomb. We're gonna take out the Oberkommando, cripple the Nazi leadership, and destabilize the fucking country and let the people know that the fight is back on. Blazkowicz, load up. I'm sending you to Roswell with this. Roswell is out of helicopter range, so we'll drop you off by the coast near Galveston. From there, you will catch a ride to Roswell. Rendezvous with Super Special at Papa Joe's All-American Diner and plant the nuke inside the very heart of the Ober Command. Then, you blow that shit the fuck up. Okay, Blaskowitz, look for Papa Joe's All-American Diner. Meet Super Special inside the restaurant. Do not break cover. Concert tonight? Oh, Jeb here is. He's a, a big fan of DK Frank's Jeb. Well, the music makes me happy. What's wrong with that, Wayne? What's wrong with that, Jeb? I like your style, Americans. Very good. You're part of the Reich now. Subject of the Great Führer. I hope for your sake you consider the Reich and all its glorious people your own. Yes, of course, mm -hmm. sir. Sure. Let me give you some free advice. You are witnessing a new dawn for America. You have a choice in this new world. Because the time will come when, how do you say, the wheat detaches from the chaff. Have you taken your German lessons? Oh, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Good. You, how do you say thank you in German? Oh, of course, sir. Let me see. It's, um... Yes. Dank. Dank. Yes, out with it. Dank. Dank. <laughs> My God. <laughs> was that all right? No, that was terrible. You're butchering my beautiful language. It's Danke schön, verdammt. Say it. Uh, Danke schön? Incorrect. Danke schön. Danke schön? I've heard enough. No more. Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. I'm still practicing. You will practice harder. Oh, I will, sir. I am 
so sorry. I got today's news for you right here, mister. Only one Reichsmark. Say, mister, you look familiar to me. Are you some kind of celebrity? Look at you people. Celebrating your own destruction. Just listen to that lovely marching beat. I'm so happy you Germans brought some culture to this country. Kamadat ne Neitner? Did I pronounce that right? You really must correct me if I didn't. Sie können hier nicht durch. Wegen der Parade. Und pass the test on change of a day with the highest points. Papa Joe's All-American Diner. My kind of dive. Was hast du heute gelernt, Peter? I don't know. Stuff? Practice your German, dear. You'll need it. Was denn für Hold Sachen? Hold your horses. Das der Führer ist ein großer Autor and Maler. Oh. Hello there. Sir, so please my younger. have a seat at the counter. I'll be right with you. Ma'am, what'll it be? We're about to close, unfortunately. Oh, it, it's to go. We'll be quick. Let's see. Uh, I'll have the... Blazkowicz. Speci knows you're coming to attack the Oberkommando, but he has no idea you bring in a damn atom bomb. You gotta break him the news. Hello? Hello? Come on, Peter. Let's go someplace else. But, Mom, we no have any... buts! Oh! Bitte schön. Danke. Well, good day, ma'am. You, one strawberry milkshake, please. Oh, I hope you don't have a fire back there to put out. If so, I'll come back another time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure the fire can wait, Commandant. One strawberry milkshake coming right up. Fireman, I recognize your face. Very Aryan face it is, too. Are you out of Station One? There you come, up. Oh, vielen Dank. <laughs> mm. Now you, show me your identification papers, please. Mm. I love strawberry milkshake. It's perhaps my favorite American thing. So simple. It's just milk and ice cream. The rest of the menu, however, I think you will need to address. I think it needs to be more German. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Tell me. Are you from here, John Smith? Huh? I read here that you operate out of Station 6. But what is the location of Station 6? I'm unfamiliar with this station. Speak up. Commandant, Sie werden vom Oberkommando verlangt. War das nicht Zeit? Trink grad noch meine Erdbeermilch. Leider nicht, Commandant. Das Oberkommando verlangt, Sie umgehend zu sehen. In Ordnung, ich, ich komme schon. Oh, 
shut the fucking front door! Before any more goddamn Nazis show for milk... Not that I don't trust you, Blaskowitz. There's nothing saying you couldn't be wearing a mask made to look like William J. Blaskowitz to hide your alien space lizard facial traits. So, I made the password that Grace gave you. She didn't give me one. Right. Off with the mask. Show me your lizard face, motherfucker. Super special. Lower your weapon before I break your arm and put your lights out. I knew it was you, Terror Billy. I was just fucking with you. Come follow me. So, um, welcome to Mission Control. It's, I haven't had much of a chance to clean up around here. I'm, I'm sorry about that. It's, um, good stuff, this shit right here. It keeps the signals from getting through. Very effective against alien mind-reading devices. How's Grace? Good. Baby Abby? Fine as cream gravy. Christ, I miss her. Even the pissing in the face part. You know? I mean, maybe I miss that the most. <laughs> Little fucker. <laughs> so what have you been doing down here, Super Smash? This place? My papa and me used this place to collect all the evidence we could find of the government cover-up. Cookie? Uh, it's been, been more than a decade now. Uh, summer of 47. I was the same year I quit working as a lawyer. In the year I joined the Black Revolutionary Front, after I got Grace acquitted from that murder charge that the goddamn FBI pigs trumped up against her. Anyway, one night, Papa heard something on the police frequency, and he brought me up north to Murphy's Ranch, where we found this flying saucer-like thing had crashed into the ground. And wouldn't you know it, the U.S. motherfucking military swooped in and quarantined off the entire Peru. Gave us some kind of bullshit story about a weather balloon. <laughs> they were lying out of their asses, because we made off with some actual hard evidence. Here, take a look at this. Huh? Pulled that baby right out of the crash site. Now, does that look like something that came off a weather balloon? This place is where we kept the records and started surveilling what the military is up to. Papa built most of it. So you reckon what you saw was a spaceship? I'm, I'm not saying it's a flying saucer from outer space, but it was clearly extraterrestrial in origin, if you catch my drift. It's all fucking connected, man. If you trace the chain of causation, you find yourself in a secret underground facility about 10 clicks east of Roswell, up by Bottomless Lakes, Area 52. Our government captured an alien flying saucer, and they stored the salvaged bodies and technology in an underground vault. Everyone was involved. The FBI pigs, the military pigs, even the goddamn King President Pig himself. Check this shit out. What? Area 52, Area 51, over here, Area 48, Area 56, all over the Southwest. Nevada, New Mexico, it's one gigantic complex and it's connected by underground train tunnels. <laughs> look, look, look at the pictures. Plasma guns, mind control, anti-gravity engines. And after our coward ass government surrendered to the fucking Nazi pigs, our new masters took over all these bases and they kept doing their own experiments to, to further their own fascist agenda. Look at this. This whole thing is the Area 52 military compound. Up here, it's the, the Nazi head honchos installed the fucking Oberkommando. But down here below, it's a cavernous vault full of all kinds of weird ass technology, alien shit. It's, it's all down there. Now, I haven't seen it myself, but it's there. Well, whatever it is, it, 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 it ain't Martian. No, okay, all right, all right. We, nobody knows for sure exactly what kind of technology we're dealing with, but it's most likely space alien based. It ain't space aliens. I talk. How the to fuck do you know? Are you, are you are you some kind of expert on all things extraterrestrial now? Look, I've been a lawyer a long fucking time, and I know a motherfucking conspiracy when I see one. No, okay, I'm not saying it's space aliens, right? But it goes without saying it's fucking space aliens. So I got a nuke in this here fire extinguisher. Okay. Cool it. I did not mean to rile you. 
Grace told me that you know a way into the Oberkommando. You get me in there, I will use this nuke to blow the top brass of the Nazi leadership to smithereens. Yes! Yes, of course! That sounds so good. I'm here to help. Papa dug these tunnels to the underground train system that connects all the top secret military bases. This tunnel goes right to Area 52 cargo train loading depot. All right. Now, you should put that nuke in uh, this backpack to keep your hands free for shooting. All right. Lots of Nazis down there. And other things. Now, I'll keep in touch on the radio. Help you out. Hey. Stay frosty, Blaskowitz. Keep going down that tunnel, and you'll end up at the Area 52 cargo train loading depot. Fastest way to Area 52 will be to hitch a ride on one of those cargo trains.
Das war das war. Nicht.
sollten bis oben hin zu
You need to shove that nuke right up in their filthy Nazi nerve center. The Oberkommando is situated at ground level directly above the cavernous vault with all that alien shit inside. You gotta haul your ass on up there, baby.
So, you want the Nazis to leave the warhead alone once you planted it, right? Well, what you gotta do is place it in the Oberkommando's nuclear reactor. That way, the Nazis won't be able to track its radiation signature. They won't find it, they won't disarm it.
Verfolgten geht. An alle hochrangigen Mitglieder des Oberkommandos bereit machen für sofortige Evakuierung. Halten Sie Ihre Verfolgungen. Sickness on the community and a bad influence, dirty and thieves, and beggars and bums, and they don't know how to read or write, and that they're stinky and stupid and lazy and way too lazy working on his job. Well, my daddy did, but my mama say white folks is mean as all get out, and hating and resenting on account they used to keep all colored to slaves, and now they're not allowed no more. And that's why I can't use a good restroom at the fair, and the man in the store won't let me in so I can buy chewing gum or soda pop. Well, what kind of 
chewing gum you like? Engine Scouts. Red or yellow? Yellow. I hate the red ones. The red ones taste like puke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what you got in that jar, Billy? Oh, it's nothing at all. It's for catching tadpoles. What you gonna do with tadpoles in that jar? Just go watch them swim. I feed them crumbs and carrots from the yard. Then they become pinky frogs. Well, I've seen tadpoles down the stream. Ooh. Follow me and I'll show you. Oh. Uh, okay. Come on. Ah. Remember you showed me the ring, Mama? For when I met someone special. Well, I did. And then a look right on her finger. secret okay promise not to tell anyone yeah okay I'll whisper it somewhere, Billy, inclined to this day to endure amongst the living. Oh, God. 
来。Goddamn ruckus. And in Howard, they followed me. They they pinned me down and they took my pocket knife. What the hell is wrong with you? You let them take your property? They're gonna walk all over you till there's nothing left. Now, I gave you that pocket knife. It was in your care. It's your responsibility. I will speak to their parents. You will do no such thing, Sophia. Oh, you gonna let your mommy fight your battles for you, are you, boy? Now you go on out there and take back what's yours, and you are not setting foot in this house again until you do. Son, I have tried reasoning with you. I've tried smacking sense into you till the cows come home and nothing is working. Every night you wake me up with these noises. No matter how many times I try to tell you there are no monsters in our basement. I'm sorry, Daddy. At night, I see them. Clear as daylight. They're coming to kill Mama. All right, here's what we're gonna do. You take this. Wow. Now you and I are going down into the basement and any monsters that show up, we shoot them dead right between their eyes. Sometimes the best way to fix a problem is to face it head on. You with me? Yes, Daddy. Sophia, you in on this? You see them? No, Daddy. The monsters are gone. Well, I reckon if you do no wrong, ain't no monster gonna come after you, son. You think we scared them off for good this time? May I keep the gun?
I'll be in the grave rotting away, and still a better daddy than you. The place is gone to shit. I ain't been down here in nary a decade. I own a 2,000 acre ranch up by Forney Lake now. I heard on the radio you'd been sighted up near Roswell. I figured you might show up here. Nothing in this house but bad memories. So why'd you come? Need a place to hide? You need money? Well, you're barking up the wrong tree, son. Far too late to come begging now. Ain't nothing you can offer to make up for what you've done to us. I think of my father, I see a fuck you and a fist flying in my face. When'd you ever do right by me? Disobedient? Ungrateful? Sense like a flat tire? and a mouth like a sewer. Oh, I saw where you was headed. I've been down that hole myself. And I guarantee goddamn to you, I did all in my might to pull you out. What more do you want from me? I wanted you to treat me like I matter. Like I wasn't some piece of dog shit got stuck on your shoe. I did my damnedest with you. The truth is, you were broke beyond fixing. What, are you some sort of super killer terror bomber now? You're on the wrong side, buddy. All them years, I was banging my head into the wall, coming to see that everyone was against me. And when the Nazis took over, things got a lot better. You play by their rules, you can do very well for yourself. Ask anyone around these parts, Blaskowitz is a name of renown and respect. Everything you touch turns to shit, and I do not need your stink on my name. Wanted murderer. Run off to the army as soon as you come of age broke your mother's heart. Where is she? She's gone. When? What happened? What happened is we had a big goddamn war, and now we got a new government with new rules. They took her. She's gone. And what's that queer outfit you're wearing? What do you mean they took her? They rounded up all the Jews and the coloreds and the queers. This is a white man's world now. White man's got to keep it Christian. You sold her out. So what? Wife made a living bemoaning me and raised a boy into a murderer. Well, I always saw you for what you are. 
Ten pounds of shit in a five pound bag. On your knees. Daddy, I'm your son. Down on your fucking knees. Was a time I was scared of you. Was a time I'd have pissed myself, had a gun pointed at my head. You know what I feel right now? Not a goddamn thing. Who'd you call? I heard everything. Who in the hell'd you call? Ich bleibe. 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 Ich b
hin. Ah, das war dir zu sterben! Yes! Yes! It's all a show. And I'm the guy wearing the black hat. No, 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 I, no, I say. You will not deny me access to my client. You see, you see this? Read it. I am entitled to confer with my client in absolute privacy. Do you want me to call the judge? You will be looking for another job tomorrow. You hear me? Now, you let me see my client, or are you going to test me? Um, what is this? The... Take that hood off of him. Schnell, motherfucker. Oh, come on. How is he supposed to talk to me when, he, when he's got that, that, that gag thing covering his mouth? Not my problem, it stays on. Oh, Christ. Will you just give us some privacy, please? Oh, you look like ass, man. Fuck. Looks like you're at death's door. Seriously, this is not a good look for you. Anyway, listen, uh, your trial's coming up in a couple of weeks, and after that, they're gonna execute you, and that whole charade's gonna be televised to every living room on the planet. So instead of that bullshit going down, we're gonna break you the fuck out of here right now. It's kind of a risky plan, but the security they have around you is out of this world, so it's kind of the only play we got, all right? I mean, the hoops I had to jump through to get to you, and I'm your fucking lawyer! That pissed me off. But, hey, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make like you attacked me, and when the guard pig comes in looking for your ass, I'm gonna sneak up behind him, and I'm gonna shove this little number right into the base of his skull. I'm gonna grab his keys and his gun, and I'm gonna roll you right on out to the elevator. <laughs> Popping Nazis wherever they show up, straight down the garage, where boom, body and Anya and everyone else has the getaway car. Okay, you ready? Let's get this freak show on the road. Go! Fuck! That hurts so bad. You don't even know. Let's get this fucking gang thing off you. All right. Once we hit the street, it's all car chases, flying bullets. They got tanks outside, man. We got some tricks up our sleeve, though. If we make it that far. We make it. The hard part is getting down to the garage. Hey! Help! Help! Open the door! He fucking attacked me, man! He broke my nose, and then he got out through that door right there! Fucking Terror Billy! He's on the loose! Stay back. And, and, he, and he had help. Uh, they, they came in right through that door, and they broke him out. It was space aliens, man. Schnitt! Gott! Zimmermann! Sie haben Talent. Sie sollten zum Film gehen, bei Helene vorsprechen. Guter Schuss, General. Der zuckt noch. <laughs> Idiot. He was dead as soon as he walked into the building. Tapfra, kleiner Liebling, ich bin dein und du bist mein. Liebling, so lieblich und open your mouth. That's it. Huh? How does it taste? Shh. How does it taste? The gunpowder of the bullet that killed your friend. How does it feel? Do you love the taste? You hear that? It's my attack force. Mm. Moving in on your friends in the garage. You're so boy. I'm gonna go down there now and join in on the fun. 
Anya. My family. Weeks pass. Or more. Feel myself slipping away. Got me praying for the end. For theft and destruction of public and private property. Aiding the enemy. Torture. Terrorism, including nuclear, both domestic and abroad. And high treason. For gruesome murders that number in the thousands, you have been found guilty, Mr. William Joseph Blaskowitz. It is rare, even for a man of my job description, to come face to face with true evil. And it pains me that the maximum sentence that I can bestow upon you is something as trivial as death. Death, Mr. Blaskowitz. Nothing but swift, sheer death. Bailiff!
妈妈。I thought I lost you, Mama. I thought I'd never see you again. Oh, Billy. Life is full of unexpected things. Some make you cheerful, and some break your heart. I wasn't there when you needed me. I ran out on you. It hurts so much, Billy. It felt like my heart was being ripped out of my chest when you left. But all hardship is temporary. Do you know this? And most of it is inevitable. I had to stay behind so that you could leave. And now you're the one in trouble. Do not worry for me. My troubles are over, my son. I don't want to go back out there. I can't do this anymore. You are strong, Billy. We are survivors, you and I. We keep fighting even when we do not know how. You cannot help but be my son. I'm having twins, Mama. They're not born yet. I. I want to see them. I wanted you to see them. I miss you. We will be together soon. You just have one more hardship. To We have less than seven seconds. Okay, ready, steady, Max Bombate! Damn it! Oh, I got it. Hurry! In three seconds, we need to give his brain oxygenated blood or it will die. Life. I'm a 
afraid it's too late. Oh, no. No. What? Brain activity! Yes! It's alive! Oh. Oh. Wow, man! Oh, this is just too far out there, Sans! Yes. Yes. The Vax is right. You should get out of here. The man ready for transport? Look! Look! He's awake! Holy cow! The god of immortal space fish swimming in his fishbowl! Hail, space fish! Mr. Blaskovich, can you hear me? Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, so listen to this! <clears throat> Some time ago, Caroline obtained this latest generation biologically engineered super soldier body from a Nazi scientific lab. Very, very impressive specimen. Anila, please show this to him. Look, William, Seth is going to attach this to build a connection between your head and your new body. Igor! Kindle, please, I'm a Nazi guy. Please come and help me here. Now, these are very rare Nazi combat equipment from super soldiers. Our fight is found in the field. None of them is working, but I have enough material to fix one contraption. You should decide which one you want. You can choose. Blink once for this one, blink twice for the one in the middle, blink three times for that over there. Okay, Ingela, let's get to work. I will sedate you now. See you soon. I'm a god, and you got and you got and you got and you. How you feeling, Mr. Blaskovich? Can you move your body? Yes, you can. Show us. Show us. I feel powerful. Do you remember your name? Do, do you remember your doings in the last two years? Aside from killing Nazis. <laughs> if you die one more time, William. I will murder you. Come, I'll give you some clothes. Send them to me when you're done. No, have you seen Ketzele? Must you give me? Must you give me? Shim shim. I get the shim. He's the best of Laskovich. How I look? Like a new man, Nicola, a new man. Now, this, same thing Shoshana has. This, no, 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 no. This connects your head to your body. Very, very important not to fiddle with this. Now, you might feel some weird tingling sensation, not to worry, it's normal. But let me know if anything else happens. For example, your head trying to reject your new body, something like this. It's hot! Max! Max! 